Welcome back, guys. I'm going to show you how to get Ren's treasure chest here in the game Werewolf Within. So you can see when you go in the game, it says three boxes award the event badges. So you got box one, box two, box three. Basically, what you have to do, this game is similar to Among Us. You have to play three rounds, and you have to win. Uh, they may change it to where uh, you don't have to win, and if you're a ghost, you can still collect things and get these items. But uh, I believe right now you have to win the match in order to get it. So basically, you go in one round. In here, there's several different rooms, and randomly, there's going going to be one of the treasure chests hidden in one of these rooms they're pretty easy to see though uh, it's gonna be a different location for each person in the server and so it's localized so uh, just make sure you go through this whole thing check every room it's really easy to see once you go into a room you're gonna see a big like glowing treasure chest right there see it's big it's green it's got all those particles it's really difficult to actually miss it so that's what it looks like in every single uh, of these rounds that you're gonna do it's not like you have to get a box and then a staff and actually find him you just get three of the boxes they look exactly the same but when you're done you're gonna want to go and do all of your tasks because you want to win the game basically also i think you can also get it if you are the uh, basically the imposter or the impersonator or whatever it is or there's an investigator and an impersonator or there's a werewolf and there's an investigator so if you're the werewolf yeah same thing but anyways after you got the first one you see you go back to the main hub and you're going to have that one filled out so next thing you're going to want to get is a second one and then you're going to have to go in for a third round and get a third box so basically this one is going to take a little bit of time especially if they have it to where you have to win and, or finish a round in order for this thing to happen because you have to go through three full rounds now it would be cool if they nerfed it and made it to a point where you get like three different crates in one but that might also be too easy so uh here we are we're going into our second round of the game and uh generally if you're a towns person you're okay uh just try to hopefully avoid getting eaten by any of the wolves so uh this is the second time just keep running around it wasn't in the same location as the first time it was in a totally different room so you guys can see here those little green arrows that's going to point you towards your uh your missions or your tasks basically so just like in among us those are just taking you to your tasks it's not going to take you to the treasure chest see right here we found this treasure chest here in the corner but yeah as soon as you get into the room where it's in there it's usually pretty easy to see it because it just stands out it's got all those particles sometimes they're like kind of tucked away in the corner or something but they're usually not too difficult to find so uh now that we've got the second box right there you can see you go back into the lobby after the game finishes up and then you can come in here and uh we got ren's staff because we've got two boxes you can see i'm chatting there with insanely luke make sure you guys give this game a thumbs up and go check it out if you guys are into among us or any of that other stuff this is probably a similar game that you guys can go through and probably enjoy just as much so when i was going to the rooms i just sort of went upstairs and then basically hugged the left and tried to keep going through different rooms but of course you've got that map there on the right side which is always there to help you if you need to figure out where the rooms are uh but these tasks right here you can see as you pass them they will glow yellow when they're ready uh you can see right here here's the third treasure chest now so we finally found it but you see that one's sort of tucked back there in the corner uh but then when you're done with that you want to go and get your tasks done and try to survive because you want to win so i spent not as much time looking for the treasure chest i spent more time basically going through and trying to get the tasks done uh when i was done with that part so you can see right here i'm just going through gonna speed it up while i'm going through those tasks so uh that is how you get this one here it is a wren's treasure chest all right, and at this point, uh, when the game ends, it's going to take you to the main hub, and you see right there on the bottom right, we've got the badge, and you're going to have all three of the boxes, and you're going to have Ren's treasure chest. Thank you for watching, guys. If you'd like to support, please use code DEATERPLAY when buying Robux, and also make sure you subscribe, and you've got the notification bell on, not only for the launchers, because I've got launchers for all of these launch boxes, but also future news, events, and free items that hit the catalog on Roblox. So thank you for watching, and we'll talk to you guys later.